All right, in this video, we're going to look at an example of subtracting whole numbers. So in part A here, we're going to take 576 minus 123. And then in part B, we're going to do 443 minus 142. So just like with addition, um, I like to write these uh, up and down vertically. So I'm going to do part A first. We'll do both uh, in this video. So 576 minus 123. And again, notice we have everything lined up, uh, you know, the hundreds, the tens, etc. So uh, what I'm going to do here is I'm just going to do it a column at a time. And both of these examples you're going to see are, gonna, are, are set up nicely. Because um, we can, you know, if we look at the first column, for example, it just says, well, 6 minus 3. Well, we can take 3 away from 6 and be left over with 3. Likewise, 7 minus 2 is just 5. And well, 5 minus 1 is 4. So it says if we do our subtraction, we'll be left with 453. So if you've got $576 and, hey, somebody takes away 123 of your dollars, you've got 453 left. Okay, so let's do the next example as well. So 443, somebody takes away 142. Well, let's see, 3 minus 2 is just 1. 4 minus 4 will leave you with 0, and 4 minus 1 will give us 3. So it says 443 minus 142 is going to equal 301. 